This is surely the buy of the hour. If you do not have a dash cam in your car, I, I'm asking you to please get one. Because, you know, emergency services, police, vehicles, for a long time have had them in their cars. Mm -hmm. um, over the past five years, they've become more and more popular here in America, in Europe, very, very popular. This is the extra pair of eyes on the road. It's the recorded video for the insurance company. If God forbid there's a collision, that he said, she said argument. Now we've got the evidence and the proof. If your son or daughter a loved one drives every day, let's put a dash cam in the car. Joe had to really convince me nearly four years ago when I bought mine, because I'm useless, I'll admit it. Joe, if I had to remember to turn this on and turn it off, that would be the day that something happens when I You're forgot right. to do it. This is all automatic, it does it all for you, you don't need to worry about anything. Here's why we're really over the moon and I promise I'll stop talking. This is our Polaroid best-selling 1080p high definition night vision uh, parking uh, sensors as well. So if somebody hits the car when your car is parked in the car park or on the side of the street, it starts to instantly turn on and record. We are down to a price of $39 with the five flex pay while supplies last. I have the original color. The classic black, easy and simple. And Joe, I mean, we're not kidding around. This is not a luxury, it's a necessity. You're exactly right, especially because there's an accident every three seconds in the United States. And when there's a, that accident, it's always two people telling two different stories. How much would you pay to have an eyewitness for you? That's what this dash cam is. It's an eyewitness that records absolutely everything. And it records it in high definition video. It's a little dash cam right there, that lens right there from Polaroid, a brand that's been around for over 90 years, bringing us some incredible optics. They've now brought that optics to your car. So I'm gonna show you what that footage looks like. Because for a lot of people you think, okay, less than $40, this has gotta be grainy, this has gotta be pixelated. Adam, this, this is unbelievable, the quality that we're able to maintain at this price. Mm. So as you see the footage, not only can I see my lane, I can see off to the right, I can see two or three lanes to the left, I can see off in the distance, I can see the cars who just passed, I can see the intersection. When we talk about an eyewitness, this absolutely sees everything. Because it has that resolution, which is the best we've ever had, at 1080p, but it also has an ultra wide 120 degree angle. It really picks up everything. But it also picks up every second while you're on the road. Here we were just driving down the road. Now I'm driving down the road to work. And as I drive down, oh. all of a sudden, Adam, this motorcycle comes flying through between all three of us. Right. And if that motorcycle would have hit one of us, Oof. how do I tell the police officer, nope, that guy was illegally driving. He could have said something otherwise. I could have been potentially at fault. Who knows what happens, but it's the dash cam that watches everything. So here I am in a roundabout. Now I'm supposed to continue around to the left. Yes. I have to slam on my brakes right here. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Because that guy was making an illegal right turn from the left lane. But if you look at it again, watch what happens if I would have hit him and I didn't have my dash camera. Because what ends up happening is right about here. If I pause it, technically I'm behind him when I slam into him. Sure. Because I'm behind him, I would have been at fault. My insurance premiums would have gone through the roof yeah. because that guy was making an illegal turn. But that's not the case anymore. Because now they have also has a lens or a, a, there's a, a display on the backside that also can you can show the police officer right there during that accident. You can show him exactly what happened during that, um, during that traffic accident. You can see everything right there. So it even has live playback. And Adam, when you talked about automatic, this thing is 100% automatic. All you do is you turn the car on, the dash cam detects the power, it starts recording. Just like I slammed on my brakes there because somebody cut me off, the dash cam even detects that, and then it locks down that video clip for about three to five minutes so then you don't accidentally record over it. Then when I turn the car off, the, car, the dash cam stops recording. So all you have to do, Adam, you drive about your regular business every single day, and if you ever get into an accident, you ever need that footage, it's always there, and, and always there being recorded. I'm so passionate about this because it's, I mean, every single word of this is fact, it's true. You know, my wife was involved in two crashes at virtually the same place two years in a row on the same month in December. Um, if she had not had the dash cam, it would have been a nightmare. I mean, an absolute nightmare. And she did, and it was okay, and we proved it. And my insurance premiums didn't go up, and the police officer that arrived was able to review the footage. You gotta get one of these. It, what it is, is no hassle, no effort, no anything. It's $39, and it's always there. It's always protecting you, it's always working for you. And if God forbid something were to happen, you can, you know, rest easy, take a breath, knowing that you got the video. Besides, 
the bottom line is real simple. The money is nothing. The money is neither here nor there because so many insurance companies are now offering a discount for those drivers that have a dash cam. Now mine didn't when I first got mine, but two years ago they started offering it. So for 39, for whatever, I, I'm saving more than that anyway per year with my insurance bill. The reality is it's your wife who's driving every day doing the school run, it's your husband who's perhaps you know, on the road, maybe working in sales, maybe there's a, there's a Lyft or Uber driver out there. Perhaps somebody is always in the car or your son or daughter just got their driver's license. It's no money at all to create such a sense of security and well-being. We have eight minutes or sellout. This is the final presentation of the day. We have at this stage over 450 people placing orders. It is our best-selling Polaroid. And even going back to the basics, Joe, I mean, mine is a Polaroid, but the very older model now sure. compared to this. Polaroid is one of the biggest brands in the world. It absolutely is. You know, they, they started creating cameras. And that, those are the cameras that we're taking all of our memories with. Now they're putting those same optics, those same lenses on a dash cam because now when you get in an accident, you need to have that high-definition footage. I'm going to show you how simple this is to install, though, because a lot of people think, as I'm adding technology to my car, this might be too difficult. This is very simple and easy to add. It has a basic suction cup mount. So you can put this anywhere that you want along that windshield. You know, we have ours tucked down right here below the rear view mirror. I like to have mine tucked up a little bit higher. My wife likes to have hers way over on the left side. Once you go ahead and have it in, in place, then we give you about 10 uh, feet worth of cable. Then you run that between the trim of your window and the trim of the vehicle. Then it tucks away. It looks like it's professionally sure. installed. That's it, Adam. Then you're done. Well, Oh, by the way, you can also swivel this thing around. If you want to record what's going on in the back of the vehicle, we do that all the time because my kids love to sing in the car. Yeah. And Adam, every Friday, we get the kids after school and we go out and have some ice cream. And it's the conversations, it's the memories that you're making in that car. It could be a road trip. For us, it's our ice cream trips mm -hmm. that we take every Friday. And you can turn it around and you can see that footage. And it makes it really cool to be able to see everything that's on the inside of the cabin, all because you have that, really, that high definition footage. And and here it's like, I, I'm eating the ice cream. My wife didn't get ice cream that day, but my two kids are Mr. in the back Cool seat. dude with your glasses on, Joe. Hey, thank you very much. Got the sunroof open. It's a beautiful day in Florida. But also notice that I can still see perfectly out that back window. Because it's such high definition detail, if somebody rear ends me, if you have it turned around, you can absolutely see everything. And by the way, this comes with a memory card. As soon as you take the memory card out of your computer or out of the camera, you plug it into your computer, this is what happens. It creates all these different little video clips. So now you get to pick and choose what do you want to show to the police officer? What do you want to show to your insurance company? Mm -hmm. What do you want to keep as a memory? Maybe you came down to Florida and saw one of those beautiful sunsets over the Gulf. This is the absolutely the best dash cam that we've had. Do you know how many people over the years have called in about the one point that I'm about to make? How many folks watching right now park their car on the side of the road, on the side of the street? Mm -hmm. You know, you, you, you leave the car overnight and you go back out the next morning and somebody has slammed right into you or knocked or jarred your wing mirror, right? This is going to help you stop that. Joe, tell everybody how. Well, this has parking guard built into it. So, boom, if somebody hits you, there's a battery built into your Polaroid. It detects that vibration. It turns itself on. It starts recording the car, records the person, records the license plate, records it all right there in high definition. For me last summer, it also became an anti-theft deterrent because there were kids that were going around the neighborhood mm. during the summer in the middle of the night, just open up car doors, see whose sure. cars were open. But as soon as they op pulled the car door, that was enough vibration. It woke up my Polaroid dash cam. That lens illuminated the entire cabin of the car, and I've got footage of these kids running away. Because as you see right now, I've got no, nothing's plugged into it. It's still working, Adam. Yeah. It still has that battery. They do that, because most cars, when you turn the cars off or you get into an accident, the power's shut, shut off to everything. They do that for a safety feature. But if you get into an accident, you still want to be able to record because your insurance company, their police officer will say, did you get footage? Do you have video of it? Do you exactly know what happened? This is really your eyes and ears during that accident and also after that accident too. And also because it's so small, you might be planning a summer vacation. Take it with you on a summer vacation. Take it with you um, on those rental cars because if you get a ding in a rental car, 
Man, those rental car companies yeah, sure. are so fast to charge that credit card. This is a great way to keep everybody honest because it's recording every second while you're on the road. Final 900 before sellout. I hope you get one. It's an important purchase that can save so much heartache and it's so inexpensive. Even if you don't order this one from us tonight, please, 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 if you're ever in the market for a dash cam, insist that it's HD in, full, mm -hmm. in terms of full high definition. Insist that it has night vision because that's important. You might be parking in a car park, insist that it has wide angle view, that it has the shock sensor as well, that it records continuously so you never need to remember to turn it on or turn it off. It just loops over itself. Hopefully you'll never need anything that this captures, but God forbid you do, it's always gonna be there for you. It's at the right price to afford to get one for your car and your wife's car or your son's car or your daughter's car. I think as parents, we all feel a, a little bit worried when the kids are driving, right? Mm -hmm. This is something that's gonna help them as well. The reality is even if there is a collision, and it wasn't their fault. If there's no evidence, your premiums potentially can go sky high. The only thing I ask you to do is remember to call your insurance company. As soon as this box arrives, when you open it up, think, oh yeah, that silly guy in the white jacket uh, and the other silly guy without the jacket on, <laughs> they told me, to call my insurance company and ask about a discount if I have a dash cam. Because Joe, dash cams are not new. They've been using emergency services for a long time. You're right, almost every police officer, every, every vehicle, there's a, a police, com or a, there's a TV show that's all about our video, yeah. showing video uh, live. And this is how they do it. They record it with dash cams and it's able to record that video. But sometimes when you see that dash cam footage, a lot of times you're like, I can't recognize what kind of vehicle that was, what kind of person was driving that car. Because the, a lot of the video, it's really grainy. This is true high definition. And I'll show you another video that I've got because when you see that 1080p uh, definite high definition, watch Adam, this woman over here on the right side. Whoa, 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 whoa. She didn't see me coming at him because she was on her cell phone. Mm. And that's, uh, you know, it's illegal here in Florida to do that. So here, as she's t making a text, you know, I'm coming through the intersections. She slams on her brakes, yeah. I slam on my brakes. Even though we're only going 10 or 15 miles an hour, that's still thousands of dollars of damages yeah. somebody's gonna have to pay for. Don't take the chance of getting blamed for an accident that's not yours. Or like I mentioned, we took it out to California a couple uh, we, uh, a couple of summers Fancy. ago. And uh, well, we went to Sequoia National Park. Adam, I've never seen mountains like that. It's beautiful. But we live here in flat Florida. And it was <laughs> able to capture that entire vista because it's a 120 degree angle. Like I'm not stopping the car in the middle of the road to take the picture but my dash cam is taking that high definition footage or if it's in the middle of the night. You know, this is one of those mornings I'm, I'll often come to HSN or you might come to work before the sun comes up. I can see everything from the truck to the vehicles on the left side yeah. to the street lights ahead of me. You see absolutely everything, almost like it's daytime because it has a sensor that adjusts to daytime and also adjusts to nighttime. And sometimes, you know, you could be driving along the way and then here a car just pulls out right in front of me oh, and it's no. going, I'm no, going 45 no, no, miles no. an hour. That person's going like, 10. It's these little things that happen along the road. Even the unexpected things, like in a Florida rainstorm, it sits so close to the windshield, Adam, it sees right through those raindrops. Yeah, yeah. You can still see the lanes. I can still see the car up in front of me. It could be snowing. It could be raining. It could be just those hazardous conditions, or it could be unexpected things like the lightning hits the bridge right about sometime now. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> oh, wow, that was amazing, <laughs> Joe. Out. And it's the crazy thing. I'm like, Jeez. oh, you won't believe what happened. But I've captured meteor showers on my dash cam. Mm -hmm. I can, oh, this morning, I captured a St. Bernard. I was pulling out of HSN. I wish I would have had, I have to go through legal to get it all approved. You Somebody had a, like a little bug car and had a St. Bernard <laughs> out of the sunroof. <laughs> it's the funniest thing. But I captured it on my dash cam. That'll be coming up in a future show. That's <laughs> the fun you could have. You never know what you're gonna see. I'm thrilled that you're taking advantage of it. The amazing Joe Harrison, everybody, let us know what you think. I, I, I would never, ever be without mine. I truly and honestly, if you only get one thing, you gotta get this. Joe, thank you, sir, as always. Good so good, so good. Uh, I want to see that St. Bernard, you know that. Yeah, it's coming. That's going to be some great video. We'll sell so many more. Can you imagine <laughs> a dog hanging out of the sunroof? Um, we all like to win stuff, right?